All right, so I want to talk about this game right here, Friday the 13th, the video game. And, man, I'm so excited about this game. Like, genuinely, honestly, so excited about this game. And that's rare for me to say because there's a lot of games that come out these days, and they're just really not what they were cracked up to be. You know what I mean? Like, you get it, you play it, and you're like, ah, you know. Uh, and maybe I'm a little biased because I'm a Friday the 13th fan. I don't know. But what's really cool about this game, there's a lot of cool things about this game, but what's really cool about this game is that they actually got Kane Hodder to perform the motion capture work here in this game. So basically, all of the animations that you see here in this game uh, that come from the Jason Voorhees character are actually from Jason Voorhees. It's so cool. Uh, Gameplay-wise, this is an always online game, which I'll be honest with you, I really would have liked to have seen, you know, a campaign or an offline bots mode, but, you know, it is what it is, and I don't want to really nitpick. Uh, but players can either assume the role as Jason Voorhees, and then a bunch of other players can assume the role as the counselors. And as the counselors, you kind of have a couple of options here. You can kind of say, well, you know, let's get together, and let's see if we can try and take out this killing machine. Let's see if we can take out Jason frickin' Voorhees. Now, that's not the most feasible thing to do. I mean, it is possible. But it's, it's really not plausible, you know? So you can go back to the drawing board and say, you know what? Let's, let's not do that. Let's not go ahead and, and get, get ourselves killed right off the bat. Let's, let's work together as a team, as a cohesive unit, and call the police and, you know, try and survive the night. Try and hide and, and, tr and survive the night. And I, I think the gameplay aspects, the gameplay mechanics for this game is really going to help with, with the longevity of this game because I can see these matches kind of playing out differently every time you boot up the game. And man, I really cannot wait to see more gameplay, more screenshots, more information from the devs. But this game, I, I believe, as of this recording, is slated to ship sometime in October, which is like the perfect time frame, you know, to get this game during the month of October, during the Halloween season. It's just absolutely amazing. Cannot wait. Cannot wait, folks. And I just wanted to come on here to share my excitement and talk about the game a little bit. Hope you guys had uh, fun watching this video, and I'll see you guys soon.